let's jump straight into it. Can you beat He Never Dies with a level 1 Dia? Alright, 1000 sub special, let's get started! First up, build. Get out of here, traveling doctor. Get out of here, Fav Great Sword. I won't need you ever again after the last challenge. Let's lap on our tried and true Shimanawa, because seriously, what's the point of Dia's burst? And for a weapon, I'll let her have her signature. We can at least proc half the passive, better than none. Okay, 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 no food, no friends, no game, no sanity, take us away! The boss has three super easy attacks, but he's such a tiny little boy that you can miss his startup at times. You gotta inspect him real closely to catch him swing his head for his melee. Just look at his cute little face. He also has a ramming attack, which is a bit scary. There's very little tell that he's doing this attack, but he rarely does this whenever you're up in his face. He really only does this to close a distance. Nonetheless, I recommend attacking him with the very end of your claymore and to keep circling him, not letting him charge straight forward. Note that if he ever does this attack close up, he'll do two, not just one. Finally, he's got his ULTIMATE WEAPON! A warning banner pops up and he starts charging his super mega attack. You can only stun him by repeatedly hitting him with poised heavy attacks. Surely we have something in our arsenal that can deal heavy hitting blows at fast rates. I wonder what... He'll go down in no time if you normal attack him like always. That's it. Now you just gotta do that for it. How much HP? According to my calculations, we need to hit him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. There's one final saving grace. Whenever you stun him, you deal a huge portion of damage. So the suffering will be just a wee bit lighter. This may not be able to deal the final blow, but the surface it gives is more than enough. Nonetheless, all that's stopping you from victory is your own willpower, which is a great testament to this video. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you for the 1,000 subscribers. It was literally last year that my videos were doing this. Shh, we don't talk about that video. So many views, likes, and kind comments flood my videos, and I read and appreciate them all. To give back to you guys, I will be giving away a free welcome if enough people join the live stream, whether YouTube or Twitch. And with an audience as small as mine, you should try your chances. Plus, if you steal some money from Jeff Bezos and gift a prime sub, or any Twitch sub in that manner, I might let you get your very own sentence in the next video, within reason, of course. But if I'm not live at the moment, consider learning why in the world I use a traveling doctor set on Dia by watching this video. And in the mind of a Genshin tryhard that survived Scaramouche Child and Arlequino with the same challenge, we've shown right here and now that beating He Never Dies with a level 1 Dia is a mission complete. Until next time, have a good day, night, etc.